Hey guys, this is Kovac, and today I'm going to be doing another how to uh, transform video. This time it's going to be on Rampage uh, from the Revenge of the Fallen movie. Now, this is going to be from vehicle to robot mode and jackhammer. I'll do both. Uh, I know that this figure is very hard to transform because when I bought him, I started, you know, transforming it, just seeing how it went and everything, and uh, I instantly knew this guy was going to be a pain in my butt every time I try to do a stop motion or anything. So I'm doing the video here on my carpet so that he will actually stand because no doubt if you have transformed him you know he is a pain in the butt to get to stand alright now to transform him the first thing you're going to want to do is right here he has these yellow pieces that are atta attached to the actual shovel you're going to just pop them out on both like uh, both sides right here and then what I would do is go ahead and kind of just fold them up and get them out of your face and go ahead and pull right here Pull it up a little bit and this panel will come up. That way it's kind of out of your way right now. Alright, after that, I'm going to go ahead and right here pull it up on uh, the treads for both sides. Pop them up. Um, go ahead and pull this panel up in the back, which will pull up the actual like where where the person would be housed, pull that up too. And that'll show the legs. We'll go ahead and now flip it over, surround the underneath of it, take the legs, pull them up, and then tw turn them around. Twist it. So, like that. Okay. Um, now, we're going to go ahead and uh, start adjusting the arms. Alright, now, you're holding it right, it's hard to see it, right here. It's about, see there's a little, uh, I don't know, a joint, uh, not a joint, but uh, they got a little peg thing in here. There's two little silver holes, all right? Can't think of the right name for it right now. You're just going to kind of pop it up right here. See? For this one, it's like right in the middle of the tread on the bottom. You're going to pop it up. It kind of disconnects because there's a little peg that goes into the slot, all right? Now you're going to take this out, pull it around. This is Rampage's whip, one of them. All right? Now you got the whip off. Now right here, going to just pull it forward. And actually, you, know, you can you know, do whatever else you want to do with this. I just leave it like that. Alright, we'll do it for both sides. It's in the middle, right here. It's like right above, right in the area where the screw is. So look for the screw. And it pops up. Pull it around. Let me pull this part up, like so. Now right here is his fingers. Just go ahead and open them, and then slide so then close his hand on both sides pull the fingers up I'm sorry if you can't really see I'm, I'm not used to doing it on the carpet so it's kind of messing with me I'm sorry all right so now he's gonna look something like this something similar to that all right now flip him back over on his back again so you're seeing the underneath of the, the vehicle you're going to see his head and you got these smokestacks here Go ahead and you can like slide that in if you want. And then you're going to pull up the head so it's coming down now. So it's gonna so you can start to see here's his legs, here's the head, so that's the torso area. You're gonna take this little annoying spinning piece, push the smokestacks in, and then pull it underneath him. Like that. Okay. Now to fix his back, we're gonna take the shovel now. I'm gonna pull it down. Okay. And you're going to pull the panel so it looks like this. You're going to get it so it's flat. And you're going to angle it down again. Now, go ahead and right here in the shovel, it separates. See? It separates because the shovel's like that, and you can separate it. Now, this is going to be transforming him to robot mode first. So I'm going to show you robot mode first. You're going to take him and... Uh, actually, you know, I'm going to show you uh, shovel mode first. Uh, jackhammer mode first, since that's the first in the instructions. Gonna take the uh, part of the shovel and you're gonna slide it in, all right? And you're gonna do the same on the other side. Slide it in, and you're gonna connect them right here. So then it's just one big piece, okay? All right. And then you're gonna take the legs, which are, these are the he has hind legs. So you're gonna pull these out and down like so. Actually, the jackhammer it's more of like this. So they you have them pulled out, and then you're gonna slide them back up so like half the height, okay? Like that. And then 
they would just be hanging like that. Now that, oops, and then underneath him right here, just so I don't forget, this part where the person would be sitting in this other panel with the Decepticon symbol, you're just going to pull it up. So it's kind of like his butt. And then leave his legs straight. You can go ahead and pull these up if you want or leave them down. These panels right here, there's one on each side. Up to you. So that is pretty much him in jackhammer mode. So now I can't get him to stand on a table, but you know, especially in jackhammer mode, you cannot get him to uh, to stand. You're gonna have to hold it. So if you're doing stop motions, that's you know, ooh, and you know, for collectors or anything, I mean, you're gonna have to have something for him to prop on. I don't know if you want to use another transformer, use the wall, uh, a book, something. Uh, and also, if you actually how you do it, forgetting now. If you take, oh, that's not Jack Hammer. You got to bend his knees a little bit so they're not entirely straight. You're gonna just like bend them. Actually, you'll feel it. It's a little click, not a click, but you can feel it right there. All right. You're gonna take the smokestack part and you're going to plug it in to his legs. It's not very easy, so you're gonna have to be a little, little patient with it. Mine is completely. Ref oh, there we go. I got one side. I got the other, and it's kind of, you got to kind of force it. So be careful, especially if you're a kid. Be careful. You don't want to break this. Now, what happens when he's in jackhammer mode is like, you know, he'd be hopping around doing jackhammer, and it would push up on his legs, and it makes the smokestacks push up too. So you, I mean, it. It's nice because I guess you know he did that in the movie. Although Rampage was red when he attacked Bumblebee, but you know just kind of something else I guess to do with the figure. Now that's jackhammer mode. He's got his legs back, kind of not able to stand or anything. Now, to transform him to robot mode, you're going to unplug this right here, the, uh, the smokestacks like we just did, which is not very easy to pull out. There we go. Now you're going to plug it underneath him. I'm sorry, I apologize for that. I'm going to plug it in underneath him. We're going to go ahead and fix the front legs first. Separate them. And then you can just bend them up like so. Now since he is like a he has the spring action you know the springs in his body to make the legs bounce he does not put his legs up very high so the front legs are going to be kind of that's, that's about as good as you can get because if you push up they're going to come back down so that's about as high as his legs can go. Now for the back because we have to fix that you're going to pull down these so he has like the back legs and you separate it a bit so it's kind of like this kind of like a, a very ugly triangle so his legs are really far apart and then he should stand on his own if he's on carpet if he's on table good luck with that that was I have had very poor luck with getting him to stand on table but there you go that's how to transform rampage from vehicle to robot and jackhammer mode alright guys hopefully that helps if you have any questions let me know